Hello. Hello, read with me, friends. Today I'm going to read the story Mouse Mess. Mouse Mess by Lenny Riley. I hope you enjoy it. It has lots of rhyming words. So let's just get right to it. Mouse Mess. Mouse Mess by Lenny Riley. For my dad, who loves cornflakes. Hush, hush, little mouse is sound asleep inside his house. On the stairs, the sound of feet. Mouse is up. It's time to eat. Crunch, crunch, he wants a cracker. Munch, munch, a cookie snacker. Crackle, sweet, he rakes cornflakes and jumps into the pile he makes. Sniff, sniff, milk and cheese. Mouse would like a taste of these. Splish, splash, the milk spills out. Food is scattered all about. Sticky, gooey, jam to spread with peanut butter smeared on bread. Tipping, slipping, sugar falls. Pour and pat make castle walls. Olives, pickles, ketchup, fun. Pop the tops off one by one. Mouse steps back. He looks around. He can't believe the mess he's found. Who made this awful mess? asked Mouse. These people need to clean their house. Herbal bubble, water flows, soaks the jam between his toes. Now that Mouse is clean and fed, he leaves the mess and goes to bed. The end. I hope you enjoyed Mouse Mess. Now I'm going to ask you a question, and if you can... Let mom or dad email me or Facebook message Miss Simpson to let me know the answers. Then I will have a copy of this book for you if you do not already have that. Mouse mess. So the questions are, the three questions are, one, what color was the handle of Mouse's fork in the story? And number two is, what did the mouse make with brown sugar? And number three, what did the mouse take a bath in? And I'll give you a hint. It was not a bathtub. So what did he take his bath in? So I hope to hear from you soon, and I will get a copy of this book, if you do not already have one, Mouse Mess, to you if you can answer those questions. So see you next time.